There we go. Okay. Good. Yeah. Hi guys. So we're live from um, my best friend's Mary's campground. Shinapple, New York. Shinapple, New York. Oh, there you go. Very nice. Um, and we're going, I'm going to be putting on her brand new favorite color that I just gave her. Lexi Berry, which is our brand new hot new color that I just got. So if anyone would like to see it being applied, we're going to layer it with um, Bay Champagne tonight. I currently have on um, Bombshell, Lexi Berry, Bombshell. So I'm kind of kind of trying to make her my twin because why not? And we're going to do Bay Champagne, Lexi Berry, Bay Champagne. Okay? So I'm going to see if a little, come, some people come on. I know it's kind of late, but it is a Saturday night. I think it's Saturday, right? It Saturday. Um, yeah. So <laughs> we're hanging out at the campsite, and we're going to see if anyone kind of jumps on before we uh, put this on. But how do you know? You never know, right? Sometimes it, it'll come across like, hey, this person's on or whatever. But we'll see. We'll see if people come on. People are not having fun on Saturday night. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> They're not really watching us. <laughs> All right, so when you apply lip scents, you want to make sure that you shake your colors really, really well because there's um, something in the um, applicators that allow the color to separate because there's nothing in the, um, the colors. They're very much um, made fresh and gluten-free, virgin-free. Oh, Jessica Brownwood is on. Hi, Hi, Hi Brownwood. How are you? She lives like right down the road. Come on down. She don't live down the road. Well, she's pretty close. She's in Sleep Hill. Oh, right. Jessica, say hello to us. Hello, hello. Um, what's all that? I don't know. We're gonna try to invite. Hello to us. Okay, so um, when you apply lip scents, you want to make sure you shake it up really, really well. Um, also, you want to make sure you clean your lips. Um, anytime you eat or you drink. Oh, look! Like I made her. Made her be alive with us. Jessica, what are you doing? She went, she went away, though. She's not there. She's not there. Okay, so Mary, I'm going to ask you to clean your lips with the wipe That's really well. Oh, you want me to do it? <laughs> this is like spa treatment. <laughs> you want to make sure you wipe up all the excess um, food products or um, we did have a couple drinks. Drink products. So drink products. Hi, Jessica. Look. <laughs> She's saying hi, Hi, Jess. <laughs> All right. So we're going to start with base champagne. And we're going to top it off with sand gloss. So some of my followers, I don't currently have open sand gloss. Mary was actually really funny. Remember that one night? She was like, I would love sand gloss. And I'm like, I know. It's not on stock. And then literally the next day, it came in stock. And I was like, Mary, I got you sand gloss. She was super excited. Mm -hmm. So um, it's a perfect gloss, neutral gloss, so I'll be showing that tonight as well. All right, so base champagne. Ready? Is your lips nice and dry? Mm -hmm. Okay, so when you also apply um, lip scents, once you um, shake it up really well, this is base champagne. Mm -hmm. Is it? Yeah, it's just the applicator looks dark. Dark, right? I know. It's not that. Um, you want to make sure you wipe off all the extra um, liquid on the applicator. Nice even layers. When you apply lip scents, you want to go in one direction. So I'm going to ask you to face the camera, and then that way people can see how we apply it. And then if you have big, fuller lips like Mary does, you want to make sure you get your water line really, really well. I do tend to dip my applicator back in after I do the one layer, just so I get a nice, clean, you know, kind of like the layer for the top lip as well. So, Bay Champagne, as you can see, is a nice neutral color, kind of for an everyday wear. Um, Mary usually wears Bay Champagne like three times with um, in the office. So, hi Dana, how are you? Hi Michelle, hi girls, what's going on? Dana, don't you love the fire and ice? So Dana just got um, fire and ice for her wedding. She's getting married in a month. Yeah. Her mother got Lexi Berry, funny enough. Yeah, I know. So we're going to be doing Lexi Berry on top of Bay Champagne tonight. <laughs> okay. So, again, we're going to be doing Lexi Berry. So this is our Lexi Berry. It's a nice purpley color. <laughs> What are you doing? 
<clears throat> so this is our second layer. So with lip scents, you want to apply three layers. The reason why you want to apply three layers, and you want to make sure it dries as Mary's demonstrating with her drying. I don't have my it's fan tonight. Fan. I, I know. Fan. I don't have my fan. If Mary's I had a fan. <laughs> I'd be good. What Mary. Fan. Fan. What fan? Yeah. <laughs> Twin hand. <laughs> Twin kisses fan. Yeah. So, Mary, I'm going to ask you a question. Do you like that color as dark as it is, or do you want to go a little darker, or do you want to put another layer of beige champagne on top? What do you think? I'll go a little darker. You want to go? All right, so we're going to change it up a little bit. We're not going to do beige champagne on top. We're going to do one more layer of Lexi Berry. So that's what's so cool about this product, is that you can literally change it as you go. Like Mary said, she wants it a little darker, so that's fantastic. Especially for evening. Especially for evening, especially for drinking wine. We're going to be doing another layer of Lexi Berry. So you can kind of change your mind as you apply. So she just put the one layer of beige champagne on, and now we're going to do another layer of the Lexi Berry. So you want to dry within 30 seconds to 60 seconds of um, dry time. Again, you're going to feel it on your lips get a little bit tacky, mm -hmm. right? You feel it tacky. Mm -hmm. And then we'll apply the third layer. So this is your third and final layer. And again, I went one way and then I went the other way. But I didn't overlap. You don't want to reapply. It's kind of like nail polish. You don't want to apply in the same direction. Uh-oh. Uh Jerry's messing me up here. Jerry, you're fired. <laughs> My cameraman is fired here. Okay, so there you go. So there, now you got the Lexi Berry again, like a true color of Lexi Berry. So we toned it down just a little bit with the beige champagne, which I have both colors in stock, and you're more than welcome to order them. Just send me a message. So we're going to dry this last one, and then this is our sand gloss. So again, as you can see, it will separate the product. If you um, have the um, high Vita, it will separate the product. And the reason why it separates is because there's nothing chemically binding them together. So all you would do is just mix up the gloss a little bit, like so. And then that way you can get the full gloss. So how does it feel? Tacky, right? Nice and dry? Okay. So the gloss is not like the color. You can apply the gloss very sparingly. There you go. And now you can definitely touch your lips together. When you're applying lip scents, you don't want to touch your lips together before you put the gloss on because you don't want it to stick together. So there you go. Sand gloss. I just put sand gloss on um, in addition to this look, even though I had pearl gloss on before. The gloss will wear off, but the color will not. I put this on, what time? Three o'clock, right when I was coming here. I think I posted that I was coming here. I've had multiple drinks and still... Nothing. What about you? All good. Nothing. So, again, send me messages. Let me know. Check out my new deal. Anyone who starts up for the month of August gets a really cool fan that I might have to give Mary one now. <laughs> but um, they're really cool. And uh, um, anyone with a free, with a brand new starter glass, with the purchase of a starter, starter kit, will get a fan. Okay? Check me out. Bye, guys.